<laughs> Thank you. What we got today, chef? French toast. Here you go. Sunday meals. We'll be with you soon. All right, people. It's time to do the work. You know the drill. So we are going to do the Innsbruck 2018 UCI World Short Lap. Dude, why do you have coffee? <laughs> oh, I just... <laughs> okay. 11% climb right now. I don't know where this hill is, but we're at 10 miles. Oh, yeah. That was a burn. That's me, people. Find me on your Zwift. Let's race. I'm gonna have a little stretch, a rest, and get some gates in before the rain comes. <laughs> Say go, Dad! Put your arms up! Woohoo! You look so warm. Did you hear her screaming for you? Yeah. Is he going? <laughs> Bye! <gasps> He's going! Come on, Willow! <laughs> Alright, be in my cheer squad? Yeah! Yeah! <laughs> Watch out, Charlie. <laughs> Whoa! High five! Woo! <laughs> Tell you what, having I've had my own personal gate before in my yard in my California place, but it was just different. My whole like I always wanted it, my own gate growing up. Like it's just a small, small flat hill kind of gate to grind and. It's cool to finally have a setup that I like. I can just leave it. It's not like a big setup every time. I have to pull it out. It's just here and says. For the ones who have their own personal gate, and maybe you're wondering what I do or much of a structure, I don't do just like, oh, I'm going to come out here and do 20 gates. What I do is. Obviously get a warm up, did the road ride, warmed up there, snapped a couple slow gates just to get everything firing. And then I usually do two back-to-back -back gates. I'm only going to the 30 foot line, so it's not a huge effort. We're really just focusing on the, these first few initial uh, acceleration pedals. Normally I'd have my timers out, so I actually don't have timers currently, but we're just focusing on getting to that 30 foot. Sometimes I would even put my timers at a 15 foot mark and just focusing on those first three to four pedals. So I do a gate, I come back and usually go straight into another gate. I'll do two back to back ones. There's some give and takes, you know, a lot I'm sure there's plenty of coaches that would say you do one and then rest, which is fine, but it's, I'm just impatient, honestly. So I do two back to backs and I try to look at that more of like, it's my start sprint, and then much as the second one's still gonna be out of the gate, I look at it, okay, that's my sprinting coming out of a first turn. Makes sense? Two good efforts in, I get a little tired, and then I take a good break. I'll probably do eight to 10 gates. We're on day three now, so we've done our road rides in the mornings, but I haven't been doing gates in the last two days because of weather, so we have a rest day tomorrow. So I'll probably just push it a little more today and really kind of exhaust myself. And then uh, we can recover tomorrow. And we're gonna actually have a proper recovery day because we're about to be the week of century. So everything is based around having the body dialed for the century ride. A few more gates. Out of the start. Is ready. Lock the gate. 
happy with that one. I'm running out of stuff to do. I mean, weather is obviously an issue, but what do you guys want to see? We still got next week. We're obviously doing our training, but I know you guys can only watch so much road biking. Um, <laughs> I don't know. We know what we're doing tomorrow. The call with Rion for the fly helmets. What do you guys want to see? Leave some comments below. I have so much out here to do, to ride, but I just can't access it right now, so. I don't know. Give me some ideas. What do you want to see here at 95 Acres with 12 days in the life of the Nobles family? For now, I think I'm gonna go inside and get warm. It's Sunday, so. Hope everyone had a good weekend. Leave some comments below. Let me know what you'd like to see this week. We're over halfway. We're doing it, people. It's crazy. Sometimes it's really hard for me to get one video out a week. When I really have a goal for a video, I dedicate a full day on filming. So there's a lot of uh, there's a lot of video footage I got to go through, and then a whole another day of editing, thrown right in the middle of being a full time athlete, being a dad, taking care of a big property. So it's uh, this challenge has been really cool. Twelve days straight of of edits and. At first, I was kind of stressing it, but now it's like, I'm pretty stoked. I got a good routine. I literally feel like you guys are here with me. Every time I ride, as much as I'm by myself, I talk to the camera just like this, so I feel like I'm riding with someone or hanging out with someone, so it's cool. I appreciate the views. I appreciate you tuning in every day. Hopefully it spreads and uh, we get the word out to more people, you know? I got more how-to stuff coming, but the how-tos are just too hard to do for a vlog. Just like I said, that's a full day dedicated to filming, another day dedicated to editing. So the ideas I have brewing are uh, soon to come in uh, future videos in the next month or so. So thanks for tuning in. If you haven't subscribed already, do that for me. Subscribe, like it, ring the bell, all that stuff they tell you to do. And uh, until then, I hope everybody had a good weekend and we'll see you guys Monday. Peace.